I'm Brad Hansen here for West Coast Mazda. We're out here today at Mazda Canada's Western Regional Office. A lot of people have seen our videos and people want to know what is Skyactive Technology. So we've come out here today to speak with George Benda, technical trainer for Mazda Canada, to find out what is Skyactive Technology. A lot of people ask, why the Skyactive? And the reason the sky active is because we think that the sky is the limit. The sky is blue, the engine cover is blue. It's a great car, but it's, the sky is the absolute limit to what we can do. We're not gonna be the same old manufacturer that we were. We're not gonna stay the same that other manufacturers might want us to be. We're gonna go sky is the limit. And we go sky active engines, we go sky drive, we go active sense, we're, we're, we're moving ahead. Sky active technology is a philosophy of design that Mazda has come up with over the past 10 years or so, um, where we take a look at the engine, the drivetrain, the whole car, everything. And we look at that and say, how can we improve on what we've had historically, what the industry has historically done? And we've picked the whole car apart, the body, the chassis, the, the brakes, the suspension, the engine, transmission, and we've asked our engineers, how can we improve this? If you had a clean sheet, what would you do? So the design engineers came up with a new body style something that flows, something that is lighter, something that is stronger. Uh, we came up with a chassis that is quieter and easier to drive and easier to perform over bumps and, and smooth surfaces. But the heart of it is the engine and transmission. That's what makes the car go. And so we've said, how would you do that? And the engineers said, well, if we could get more bang out of the fuel, then we could get more fuel mileage out of the whole car. We came up with the idea that if we raise the compression ratio to as high as 14 to 1 in, in the world with premium fuel, 13 to 1 in Canada with regular fuel, we could get that power and we could get that economy. How we did it? With valve timing, by changing valve timing so that on the compression stroke when we don't need to have 14 to 1 or 13 to 1, we open, leave the intake valve open for a long time and then we get a lot out of our power stroke by opening our exhaust valve late. And so we can balance those with valve timing. Then we looked at the lubrication system and we said, why do we have to have oil pressure all the time? Why don't we lower the oil pressure in periods when we don't have it and raise it when we need it? Cooling system. Water flows easily if it's going in a circle, but if it has to go around corners, then it's rough. And so we can make the water pump smaller if we have less turbulence, and so we don't have to have so much friction. If we change the way the belts are driven and we have less drag on them, then we can make the belt smaller, lighter. We need less material for that, and so things are lighter. We've gone to direct fuel injection like we did on our early CX-7s and our Speed 3s. We've taken that high performance technology and put that onto this Sky Active engine. That increases fuel economy immensely and it allows us to jack up the compression ratio. I'm Brad Hansen, sales manager here at West Coast Mazda. Come find out why we're a better place to buy a car. We're just over the bridge in Maple Ridge. Thank you.